you can tell by the sound of the wind it's picking up in weather we're heading through a little area here between the two major roads that's wooded goes through sort of a low area here it's a little bit swampy the creek running along the edge uh, and this is a part of the trail that goes from 6 to 660 It's uh, March 25th, 2016, and we're having an early spring. A lot of things that aren't usually up this time of year are up, and the migratory birds are back. And it looks like we're going to have a little bit of a stream crossing here. <clears throat> this time of year, all of the creeks, even the small ones, are up at a fairly decent amount. So. <sighs> can be a challenge to find a spot not to get wet going across. What that? Whoa, what does that look like up there? Yeah, I'm gonna give it a try here. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, now it not look like I'm going to make it across there. Uh, maybe upstream a little bit in that shallow area. Uh, <coughs> let me go back. Sometimes it just doesn't work out crossing where the trail actually is. Uh, this is the hardest part of doing any sort of trail walking this time of year is that you can pretty well count on the can you hold that a second. Streams are gonna be up. Okay, I think this is going to work. Yeah. That's, this is the fork. The water's not quite as high here. And there's lots of higher rocks. Oh, the rocks are sort of slippery though. Now I'm going to have to use the poles to keep from sliding. Make sure I make it across without getting a boot full since I'm just starting. Well, that's Leanne. Be careful, a lot of those rocks are real slippery over here. Making it across. You don't want to fall this early on the hiking trip because it's not fun to be wet. 